Well, good morning, travelers. Welcome to a brand new year. Welcome to traveling with the Graham Cracker. I am the Graham Cracker, and this is my little sidekick, Quark. Thank you all for being here and coming along for this, this first video of 2023. That is our season eight. I'm sitting inside Vinnie, my uh, Class B motorhome, self-designed Class B motorhome, uh, and am out here in the Arizona desert in Quartzsite, Arizona. I am working this season for the Bureau of Land Management out at the Long-Term Visitors Area. If you happen to be out here, you can see me, say hi to me, stop by Wednesday or Thursday from 9 a.m. till 4, maybe even from 9 to 5, if that's pretty soon, that's what they're going to be open to 9 to 5, and I'll be there two days a week. You can say hello, and uh, maybe we can get together and sit by the campfire and maybe have a beer, who knows, or a cup of coffee, and uh, occasionally I will smoke a cigar or smoke a pipe. So um, if you want to come by and say hello, come by and say hello. Uh, thank you all for being with me all these years. For those of you that are and are still here, you guys are the backbone of this channel. Thank you very much for coming along. And uh, I do apologize that I didn't get this out on Sunday. My goal is to get these out on Sunday morning. That doesn't always happen. So um, this will be put out today. So look forward for it today. I will post on Facebook that it's coming out so that those of you that look at Facebook and watch Facebook find it. I don't do Facebook. I don't hang out there. I don't see your posts. Um, if you send a message or a text or something via Facebook, I will see it the next time I log in, um, which is probably once a week. So don't get upset if I don't answer you right away. Um, I answer when I can. Uh, you can get best get in touch with me by my email address, which is down below in the bottom of this video. You will see things like how to get in touch with me, how to uh, support this channel if you choose to. There's also the Amazon wish list, which is on hold until spring because I'm not there to pick up the mail. So in spring, I will put out another video when that will come back up and I'll add items to it take away items that I've already received and those of you that have contributed through there thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you I really appreciate the Amazon wish list because you know where your money's going exactly and I get the items that I greatly need and then I'm able to save money and buy larger items such as lithium batteries that's all down below also down below is a description of of me um, I'm a, for those of you that are new this season, I am a born again Christian. I believe that Jesus Christ is the Lord of the universe and he is God incarnate. I also am a transgender male. Um, that's a whole, whole nother video somewhere else in one of the other seasons about how that occurred. Anyway, so, um, that's a little bit about me. Uh, I am now traveling with Quark. The little wonder dog, as you can see, he's in a little coat that one of you subscribers mailed to me for Christmas. You know who you are. I know who you are. I wanted to put this video on here to show you how well your gift fits this little guy. He is seven and a half pounds. This fits perfect. It's wonderful. He's used it a bunch. See all the dirt on it and the dust. It's a great campfire thing. I can attach the leash to the back of it. So that he can play sled dog with this one too. But it keeps him nice and warm. And I got to get it off him because today is a warm day. So he doesn't need it right now. And he's not happy that it's on there because it's making him overheat. But yeah, it's lined. Um, great jacket. He likes it. Thank you very much for sending that. It was a wonderful Christmas gift. And... Uh, Quark thanks you too because he's had to use it much, 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 much amount of times because it's been cold. Has it been cold? He gets cold real easy and he overheats real easy. So I have to be careful with him. 
Um, I haven't had a little tiny dog in years and years and years. Um, for those of you that are new, uh, I did have a, a uh, Labrador Retriever um, up until Thanksgiving. He is no longer with us. Uh, go back and watch those videos. He was my assistance dog for mobility and a few other things. Uh, Quark is now in training for his public access training. And we'll go into that maybe later in a later video. But uh, he's doing training right now, which should take, oh, about a year, I suppose, for him to be um, what I would consider out of training. I am a professional dog trainer. I train assistance dogs, used to for a living. I no longer do that. Um, I'm retired. Uh, I'm also a retired engineer. Um, a few other things. Anyway, um, enough about old stuff that's on some of these videos. Go check out my videos in the past videos, past seasons. This is season number eight, New Beginnings. The number of new beginnings, and this is what this is. And I wanted to give this opportunity to thank you for coming along. Thank you for joining me. Um, we're already getting way too long. Um, this, this season's going to be partially traveling or sitting still in the southern Arizona desert and partially at uh, the property that I purchased a couple years ago sitting in the northern Arizona uh, area up by the Grand Canyon. So some of it will be on the road, some of it will be up there, some of it will be traveling, some of it will be sitting still. I don't know. It's my life. That's the way it is. You have zoned into the life in the day of a graham cracker. And if you want to know what that means, go back and find that video uh, about what's in a name. So anyway, without further ado, I'm going to get into today's video, jump in to show you what I've done. I uh, was doing some uh, maintenance work on the van and uh, doing an addition to the van. So um, without further ado, I'll send you over there. We'll see you next time. All right. Hey, one more thing before I go. One more thing. Like moves us up on the al algorithm so that our videos are out there. Subscribe really helps me financially. Keeps those videos coming to your mailbox. Hit that little bell icon to let you know when I post a video. And share. Let people know who you're watching. Why you're watching. What you're into. So anyway... Now, without further ado, we head on over to see what I added to Vinny. All right, we'll catch you later. Bye-bye. Well, this is the first video of the new year. And uh, I forgot I had this fancy gizmo with the director's view, and I can see what I'm working on. And I'll show you what all I'm working on that, that tray. Um, I had a, a guy here in Quartzsite make me a rack for the front of my van to hold the generator better and to hold my bike um, so it's welded with the receiver hitch there and one to the other end so it's got a double receiver and right now I'm just adding this piece of wood here that I've cut and I forgot I had this this uh, tripod and it's hung up with quark this tripod to be able to video um, things while I'm working on them. Let me see if I can put it down here. We'll see what I can get here. Um, I'm gonna add these bolts here. Drilled some holes, add a few bolts. Yeah, anyway, this is what I'm working on. I'm not gonna bore you with all the details, but uh, I'll show you what it looks like after. Well, I did finish the job and I got the bike up on the rack and I got the generator on and the generator's covered. I won't travel with a cover on the generator. I will with the one on the bike because it's tied down. Anyway, that's where the bike's gonna go in front. We'll try it with the cover and see if I my engine gets too warm. If it doesn't, then we're good. If it does, I'll take the cover off. So all of you out there that see this and go, oh my gosh, the cover, you're going to overheat your engine. We're going to run a test and we'll see if that's true and if it's not true. Anyway, 
nice big rack that I had built for the van. So 20, 23 will be a little easier to haul the bike instead of putting it inside the van. Um, the generator has a better home than it had before. The rack is made out of solid steel. So um, I do have a little tent that's down there. That little blue thing is a little tent that I got from a free pile that I'm going to take to the to the property last year. Um, somebody purchased some shade cloth for me and now I have a frame to to put that up and that'll make it a lot nice and a lot shadier for the puppies. Uh, we'll see what's what tomorrow. Hey Quark, what are you doing? Got a little sweater on. Oh my goodness, I called you so now you're all jumping up and going crazy. Hi, are you going crazy? Did you get a ball? Where's your ball? Say, I got a ball. I got a new ball. Come get your ball. Inside. Go. Where's your ball? Get it. Get it. Go get the ball. Get your ball. That ain't gonna work. Come on. Get your toys. Go get your toy. Yes. Get your toy. Good boy. Get your toy. Is that your toy? Is that your toy, Quark? That's your toy. <laughs> Quark got a new toy for Christmas. Yes, he did. And I got a couple of balls for Christmas too. Did you get did you get new toys? Oh, is this your toy? Can I have it? Can I have it, Quark? Can I have it? Give it to me. Come on. Come on. That a boy. Can I have it? Can I have it? Give it. Ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Give it. Thank you. Here. Sit. No. Sit. Good boy. All right, take it. Good boy. Go on. Good boy. And I found out last night that he's all of seven pounds, five ounces. So he's a little bigger than I thought he was. He was at six pounds. Now he's seven pounds, five ounces. He's a big boy. And uh, he got a new harness yesterday too. I'm not thrilled with the harness, but it'll work for a tie out harness. We won't use it for walking him or anything like that because he acts like a sled dog if you have that on him. Anyway, that's it for now. Um, that would be uh, the new year. The first day, second day of new year. Yesterday I went off to Phoenix. I didn't film that. I had a doctor's appointment and everything came out good. Um, we're still parked here with the group. Uh, they're still here. So... They're heading out here real soon, though. They're not going to be here long. Anyway, that, that should do it for the first video of uh, the new year. I hope you all had a really great, uh, great new year. Season number eight. That's where we are right now. We're in season number eight. Season of new beginnings. So let's see what happens this year. You all have a great time, and we will catch you in the next video. Follow your heart, embrace your dreams, and cherish your life, and get out there and do something you enjoy today. And we will talk to you on the next video. All right, bye-bye.